Hey guys, 22 Plinkster here. Um, I have a confession to make. Last year I made a video on the ultimate PC charger. And at the time it was the ultimate, but the good thing about the firearms industry, the car industry, other industries, just give them a little bit of time and they're gonna come out with something really, really awesome for that firearm. Let me show you what I'm talking about. <laughs> there went 20 rounds of nine millimeter freedom seeds really quick. Let's get into the video. Wow. All right, I'm gonna take these glasses off because it is very humid here in Tennessee. The Ruger PC charger. Yes, I made a video on it saying it was the coolest thing since sliced bread and you guys in the comments, tons of you guys in the comments already knew that uh, Franklin Armory came out with a binary trigger for the Ruger 1022. And you were just wondering when they were coming out with the binary trigger for the PC charger and also the PC carbine. Well, today, July 4th, 2021, they have finally announced their binary trigger for the PC charger and the PC carbine. For you guys that had don't know what a binary trigger is or never heard of a binary trigger, let me try to explain to you. It is not full auto, okay? Full auto um, is illegal to own unless you have the proper paperwork to go with those full autos, and full auto is very expensive. Um, what a binary trigger is, is once you press the trigger, it goes bang. Once you release the trigger, it goes bang, okay? Right here on the side, there's three stickers, well, three pictures on each sticker. Each one simulates what mode the firearm or the trigger is in. If the hand is all the way forward, it is in binary mode. So every time you pull the trigger, it's going to go bang. When you release the trigger, it's going to go bang. You can flip it down, straight down like this right here. It's in semi-auto mode, meaning every time you pull the trigger, it's just going to go bang once. And of course, safety is right here. A lot of people think that binary triggers are unsafe. Um, no, they're not unsafe at all. And you're wondering, well, what if you are shooting binary and you see something downrange and you don't want to squeeze off that second round? Well, it's simple. You just keep your finger on the trigger, switch it to safe mode, and that second round is not going to go off. But now that the PC charger and the PC carbines have gotten an upgrade with this Franklin Armory binary trigger, things are much more better good. Now, the only problem is trying to find nine millimeter ammo. Luckily for me, I've got some Federal uh, American Eagle over here. We're gonna load up some more happy sticks here, Glock 33 round happy sticks, and we're gonna do some more shooting. All right, I've got approximately 25 rounds loaded up here, and it is hot, it is humid. Now we're just gonna be doing a little bit of plinking here, just in semi-automatic, just to show you the difference. So when I pull the trigger, let me turn this light on a little bit brighter. When I pull the trigger, boom. All right, I let out the trigger, no second pew. All right, I'll show you again. No second pew. All right, now I'm gonna switch to binary. When I pull the trigger, it's gonna go off. When I let go of the trigger, it's gonna go off. Pull the trigger, fire, let go, fire. It's not full auto, okay? It's a binary trigger, which are perfectly legal in most states in the United States. So, all right, here we go. Let's just empty this out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you can't help but giggle every time you pull the trigger on a binary. Let me load up another magazine. Let's do a little bit more shooting. All right, I got another happy stick. Uh, I got 27 rounds. It's just hard to get those last few rounds in there, so we'll just call it even. I know it's making a lot of you guys mad that I'm shooting nine millimeter right now, but um, you know, I've got to make videos. <laughs> All right, so let's go semi-automatic mode. Um, if you're unfamiliar, with the Ruger PC Charger PC Carbines. Uh, I've made videos on both of them, so if you want uh, full details of this handgun, uh, this pistol setup, you know, you can go and watch those videos. Uh, another thing is, if you have a 40 cal PC Carbine, this trigger is going to work. Nine millimeter, it's going to work. So any of the PC Carbine or PC Chargers, this trigger system will work. Uh, MSRP on this trigger is like $299, um, and it takes probably about 15 minutes to install. Not bad, not bad at all. All right, so, Semi-automatic, let's go out to 100 yards. Just do a little bit of plinking here. All right, hit it a few times. I don't know exactly where my zero is on this. It's not about the sight. It's not about how well I can shoot. It's about having fun with this trigger. So binary mode, I'm gonna try to hit all four of those plates. 
Get my red dot a little bit brighter. Here we go. <laughs> I got all four of them. So it is quite controllable. Um, you know, Franklin Army puts out a great, great trigger. Um, I really, really enjoyed the one that they put out for the Ruger 1022. I've had so much fun with that. And now they make one with the PC uh, charger and the PC carbine. I know nine millimeters hard to find right now, 40 is hard to find right now, but trust me, it will come back. And when it comes back, you can set up a rig just like this and have a lot of fun in binary mode. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions whatsoever, you can put them in the comments below. Go over to my Instagram, Facebook page, or Twitter pages and ask them there. Remember, next time, y'all be safe and keep linking.